Pope's Exorcist. Ooh. This is the newest uh, Russell Crowe movie directed by Julius Avery, who uh, who did Overlord. Like, he came out swinging with that movie. That movie kicked ass. Then he did Samaritan with Stallone. That kind of sucked. Now he's doing this. And uh, so it's Russell Crowe's first horror movie, which is kind of wacky to think of. Uh, I mean, like, when you really think about it, uh, you know, he's been around since the 90s and really hasn't done, like, a horror horror movie like this. Which, I mean, I get if you're in fucking Gladiator, you're not going to fucking stoop down to a fucking Exorcist movie. Like, there's one great Exorcist movie, and that's The Exorcist. There's good Exorcist scenes in other movies that I like, but, like, a whole movie about, like, an exorcism? Yeah. This ain't fucking it. Uh, Russell Crowe is the absolute best part of this movie. Uh, the relationship he has with the other priest I thought was decent. And then it's just very by the numbers. You know, they get a creepy little kid who gets possessed, talks in a <clears throat> deep demon voice, says horrific, crude things to his mother. Very sexual stuff, he says. Lots of swearing just over and over and over again. And it's just not very exciting. And it ends kind of like how you'd expect it to end uh with russell crowe like no take me and then he's fighting the demon in his head and shit and then it does like a fucking marvel ending where they realize spoilers for this fucking movie that the demon is one of the kings of hell uh bocephus if i remember from the fucking movie and that when lucifer fell from heaven into the soil he went with 200 angels 200 fallen angels and he they're like this church that you that was the uh i don't know that the demons fucking took over this movie isn't really that good that you should put that much uh thought into it but um uh, that it's poisonous that there's 199 left they took out one and then there's 199 left yeah i would give this a solid one out of five <laughs>